the name of this restaurant is Top of the Rock. So having sacrificed everything out before having lost everything, now to restart over in my life, I'm more flexed up and I'm winning in my life. And it's not to brag, it's not to be materialistic. It's, I, materialism ain't shit, okay? So putting off all ego or whatever humanistic, materialistic bullshit aside, you know, obviously this, I am a spiritual being having a human experience, not a human being having a spiritual experience. So with that being said, it's just amazing to collect the vibe the energy, the synchronized and aligned attunement of your spiritual aura and your sanctuary within yourself to go out into the world and enjoy something beautiful and remarkable like this. So when I say top of the rock, this place, this name of this restaurant is like top of the rock. So I have to sacrifice everything, just be reborn. Now I'm actually flexed up. Now I have everything, but I still feel empty. And depression is no joke. So I'm raising advocacy and awareness for it. I was told today that I should be ashamed of my emotions. Look, listen, you should never be ashamed of your emotions, your individualism. Be proud, be loud for who you are and embrace your authenticity, embrace your realness and the rawness and the core of your individuality. And that's the only way that you'll win in this life is that's the way that you find and celebrate your own happiness, your own independence by not just by flexing up on your haters but proving everybody wrong not just that but the only thing you got to prove is prove everything to yourself you ain't got to prove nothing to nobody else and i come up from the hood from the projects i left section eight boy you know i gotta come up from the hood life you know and look at me now like i'm glowed up baby i'm glowed up because i believe in myself mindset is absolutely crucial in everything so instead of me being at home today and drowning in my headspace and my emotions and my feels and everything else and you know feeling sorry for myself you know i come out here to collect a more positive vibe and energy and come out here to inspire you to inspire the world inspire everything around me for for something better you feel and the most important thing in this life is to celebrate your individuality to celebrate everything for who you are what you are what you stand for as long as you do right by others like myself, you know, it, it's people like myself who are authentic and real. We share our generosity and kindness with the world. And therefore, as a result, we get fucked over in the end. But, you know, I hate for anybody else to have to go through that in life. And the most important thing that you have to consider in your life is to brace your authenticity. As long as you know who you are, ain't nothing this world could ever stop you. Look, like, look at it. It's ironic because I, I'm, I'm on top of the rock. I'm on top of the pyramid of life, of human existence, mortality. But I have everything now, but I'm still bit empty, you know? I mean, my life is lonely a bit. So, uh, you know, I mean, it's so crazy. But we're just out here. Um, and I got some chairs out here. So this place is great. This place is popping. So I love it. It's, and it's, it was a bit hot out here earlier. So I had to wait for, like, the sun to go down to come back out here to catch a vibe, you know? But this place is awesome, though. I love it. So I'm going to go walk around, see what else that they got around here. You know, it's awesome to get it. Like, free valet parking. The parking is amazing. These people work hard. They work their ass off, you know. So shout out to the valet parking everywhere. It's not just here. It's at the casinos, to everywhere, the hotels. Man, this place is just incredible. But, but never be ashamed of your emotions. Like, be proud of who you are. And don't ever allow anybody to tell you otherwise. And uh, anybody guilt trip you or gaslight you for like being the authentic you, you yourself. So that's what we're doing out here. See ya.